Who's ready to dance? I'm ready to dance. Annyeonghaseyo. I'm Stephanie, a fellow dancer, here to teach you Busho by One Us. And today I will be teaching you guys the rest of the dance. So, let's get started. From here it's going to be kind of the same as we did in the first pre-chorus, but now we're going to be going to left. So after our kick here, I'm going to, hop, I'm going to take a step to the right, hop left, right, one, two, bring it in. Hop one, two, turn to face left. One, two, come down and up. From here, I'll follow Shion's pot, but he's gonna be in the back, and we're gonna basically be going like this. So then, from here, I'm gonna be kind of following Shion's part in this case. But we're gonna go down and to left, bring it up to a bow, release, and then come up, feet together. The other people will be kind of down on that part, but that's whatever. And then from there, take a few steps. Same thing here. Like that. Slide to your spot. One, two. And bring it forward and up. So for this part in this case, or for this part in this case, this is going to be Rab N's part. So if you want to do that, you're welcome to. So I'm not going to review that part, because it's pretty much the same thing as the first pre-chorus, but to the opposite side. For the second chorus, it's pretty much the same as the first one, so I'm not going to go over that. We'll just continue on to the bridge. So, after our last one, two, punch front with the right, one, two, hit. And then from there you can add a little, do another little pose, either to the right or left or center. And then from there you're going to kind of do a thought small run, and then we're going to hop our feet, so we're facing sort of front right corner right in this case, and then arms just down the side. So I'm going to be following Juan, Juan Ming's part again, to here. So what we're going to do is we're going to come forward, down to our left knee, and then we're going to come back and place that left hand behind ourselves. From there, you're then going to slide the left hand front until you're leaning forward. Then with the hand, we're going to go right, left, up to here until we're kind of standing. So again, with the hand, it's going to be one, two, three. So notice that the right hand, once the left hand's here, right hand's just going to kind of flop over like that. So again, from here, you're then going to stand one, two. So, in this part, the standing part in the one, two is going to be Juan Wong's part. And then he's going to go one, two, and then circle to here. So, with that hand, it's basically one, two to here. And I'm going to then circle my right hand in front until my left hand's in front. So, again, like this, and then bring it together in front of your face. So, it's going to be like this, and then up. So, with that, it's going to be a run, two, one, two, to here. From here, we'll join with the majority. We'll step to the left. I'm going to circle my arms out to the side. And then step to the right. I'm going to bring it in, cross, and elbows out to the side. From there, then, I'm going to circle my arms kind of outwards and down until my palms are facing front. With that, I'm going to just place my left foot behind my right. From here, I'm then going to place my left foot behind myself so that I'm facing to the left. I'm going to place my right hand on my chest, left hand is going to come out to the front, and then basically we're going to do it like this. So this is going to be like really slow reach out, and then we're going to bring in quick, and then out quick with a punch. So it's like, so it's like this, one, two, like that. From there then you're then going to come forward and bring everything in. You can either do this to the left or right. I'm going to do it to the left. We're going to hop to the left, hands out, bring the hands together, and then right foot's going to be behind yourself. And then from there, you're going to go bring elbows out, and then cross down in front of yourself as you lean forward. Then we're going to do a hop left, right, as we circle our hands out, like this. So again, from here, it's going to be one, two. And then from there, you're going to hop 
and kind of kick and turn to the left till you're facing back and then come down. So it's going to be something like, uh, so like this and then come down immediately. From there then you'll wait like maybe four-ish counts and then from there we'll cross our right foot over our left pointing up to the ceiling with our right finger. Then from there we'll turn, keep turning to the left, bringing their right hand down. And now I'm going to do kind of a little bit of Suho's part, but we're going to go like what? So it's going to be like a kick. So it's going to be like a bring foot forward, kick back. And with the hands it's like one, just throwing that right hand forward. So one, and then two to here. So now let's view that part before we go on. So from here, we're going to go forward for two, back for two, come forward to here, and circle the arms until you're up. Stand up, one to the cheek, one to run, and bring it together. Step right, left, bring those elbows out, place that right foot or left foot behind, hands out to the side, step back, two and three, come forward, hop one, two together, and down, hop one, two, throw, come down, wait here a few counts, cross and come up, keep turning to the left until that right hand's down, Suho's part, and two. So the first part of the last course is pretty much the same as the rest of the courses, so I'm not going to go over that. We're just going to kind of skip over to the end of the dance. So after after here to throw, from there you're just going to kind of either come down and then jump up, or you can be Suho in which he will he will kind of do the opposite of what I just did basically. So whichever one you want. So I'm going to go down and then up. Then you're going to do a few runs, and basically you're going to hop, so your feet are together, really keep bringing those knees in, hands are just going to be down the side, so it's going to be like that. From here we're going to go one, so immediately from that jump actually, you're going to immediately come to kind of like a sort of wide position, and you want to make sure that your right toe is out. From there you're going to do kind of like a swivel, Bring that left foot in, so it's like one and two, one and two. So you're going to do it to the right and to the left. One and two, one and two. With that, you're just going to strum your instrument, like strum an instrument here, to the right. So after your left side here, I'm just going to step to the left, making sure my left toe is out. I'm going to bring my hands to the left here, and then I'm basically going to bring my left toe in, and as I do that, I'm going to bring my left, my right foot up like that. And with that, we're just going to change our hands and flexing our fists in this case. So it's going to be like one, I'm going to step to the right, switch to the left, step to the left, switch to the right, and two. So you're going to do two of those at the end. So again, it's going to be one, two, and one, two, like that. From here then I'm going to hop onto my right foot and then we're going to go one to the left, one to the right. So this is like pretty low and you're just picking up your feet like this. With the hands it's going to be to the head, pretty simple. So to left, right, and then one, two, three, down. So again, one, two, with the feet it's going to step to left, hop right, hop left down, like that. And then you can either Keep leaning forward, or you can kind of stand up with your arms down your side. So again, it's going to be one, two, one, two, three, down, or come up. Sorry, with the hands, it's going to be to the left side, right hand's going to come up first, right side, left side, left hand's going to come up afterwards. So again, it's like one, two, one, two, three to here, then from there, you're either going to go like Bushu or like, sorry, you're gonna, if you're standing up, you're going to go like that. 
if you're down here, I believe you go like that. So just kind of sticking that right hip out. So one hip. Then we're going to face to the far right corner. And we're going to basically bring our elbows up behind ourselves. And then from there, I'm going to kind of go into my heels. So I circle my arms around and in front like that. So again, one, two, circle around. And then from there, either slide to the right or left with this. So right hand's going to be to the mouth, left hand's going to be up in the hair. From there, there everything's kind of the same. So from here, going to be one, two, one, two, right, left, and right twice to the left, right, one, two, down. Then from here, you're going to wave like a count or two. And then from there, we're going to stand up. Gonna do little runs like this. Still knees bent. With the mouth, you're gonna go like this, like you're going like that. So it's gonna be like brrrr. And from there, you're gonna do small, small hop, arms up, arms up above your head. Bring that left knee up or right knee, and then very relaxed ending pose. So you can either do it to the right or to the left. So now to be that part before we end this tutorial. So from here, we're going to go right, left, right punch, down, hop, or whichever Suho does. And then from there, a few small runs, and hop to like about hip width pose. One, two to the right, two to the left, step to the left, and one, two, and one, two. Hop, left, right. One, two, three, down, to the right, right, circle up, and slide. Again, to the right, and left, right, two of these, hop, left, right, one, two, three, down, wait a count or so, one, two, three, boost show to your ending pose. Great job, guys. Give a hand to yourself because you learned this whole dance. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you learned all of this dance with me. That makes me really happy. And if you wish to review what you've learned in this part, it'll take a look down in the description box below. Anyways, I challenge you guys to ban me because I know you can. Also, please do subscribe for more cool dance tutorials like this. If you haven't, that would be awesome. And I'll see you guys in the next dance. Happy dancing!